Hello YouTube and welcome back to my channel. This time I'm looking at uh, another browser game and this game is called Eldevin or Eldevin or one of those things. Uh, this is a browser game and it's actually, it's, it's, well, it's a Diablo clone but it does have a lot of really cool features. Like actually this reminds me a lot of RuneScape but it does play like Diablo. So I decided to be a wizard so I'm gonna run around and I'll show you what the game is like. Um, and I right now I'm on my first quest and it's a... Uh, it's actually um, a, a harvesting quest, so I have to harvest as many things from these animals as I can. Wait, let me let me just there it is. That's what I wanted. I have to harvest. Uh, basically, I'm I'm skinning them. That's that's what I'm trying to say here. I'm trying to skin these pigs, and I have to, I think I have to get like ten of them. Um, and right now, well, the game is actually so far super super fun. So this is a free to play game. It does have a shop right here. And you can obviously buy stuff that it gives you like different upgrades and like a more backspace and um, other cool features that I'm not familiar with. But this game is uh, so far is actually ridiculously fun. Like there's like snakes here and it's a squirrel that I'm going to shoot because it's a squirrel. Because why not? Uh, you have a character sheet that looks really cool. Uh, it reminds me of Diablo. You have your uh, items here. There's attribute pins points I can distribute. I'm actually gonna give myself a little bit more sorcery because I decided to be a wizard. Three classes, so you can be a warrior, a wizard, or an archer. I chose to be a wizard because usually I judge the game by how fun it is to be a wizard in the game. And so far this is pretty pretty fun. So I have one skill. As a wizard I have my fireball, or as some people say uh, balls of fire. And either one works. So my balls of fire are pretty, pretty powerful so far. So I'm gonna finish this quest and I'll show you what else this game has. Oh, before I do that, uh, I'm gonna show you the map. So this is what the map looks like. I'm right here. This is my two other quests. Uh, there's this big, really big city right next to me. And this is, so this is a first map. And these are these other maps that you can go to. Uh, so there's a Kingdom East, Kingdom East again. And there's uh, something else. Well, I have to be level 40 to go here. Uh, and so what I'm gonna do is, that, oh, this is level 17, I'm gonna show you some of these uh, the other areas as I get to them. So I'm gonna play through this and then, you know, you, it will be your decision to make if you wanna play this as well or not. So r right now I'm really enjoying this game, I gotta be honest with you. This is a lot more, a lot better than I expected actually. This is way, way better than I expected. Uh, from all the browser games I've played, this is probably one of the best ones. And there's also other people playing this. I've seen a few people running around, so it's a quite popular game. I've actually, I've heard from a few people that it is a really interesting game, so I decided to try it. Create five somethings. How? Oh, it's a merchant. It's a trade here, I guess. Yeah. I don't know how to create that thing you asked me to create. Oh, is this what I use? No. Wait, can you tell me that again? What you just told me. So this is my tanning process. So I'm skinning my my boars, my pigs right now. I mean, uh, I'm tanning their skin. And as you can see, you get experience in skinning right now. So this is one of my talents. Uh, these are these are other gathering talents. You can uh, cut crystals. You can farm, forage, prospect, forestry, fishing. I tried fishing. I couldn't figure it out. I'm sure it's fun, but I just couldn't get into it. And skinning is what I'm doing right now. That's the one I'm probably using the most because basically I am a mage, so I can only use like other stuff probably. And also I am expected to kill a lot of animals. Thank you. All right, I'm completing my gathering quest. And that's good. I learned how to skin and, and gather gather skins from animals. All right, so let's go uh, return our quest to the north. So you can play this with WASD keys or you can just use your mouse as well. Either one works. I prefer to play with a combination of both. Uh, what am I doing now? What am I doing? What am I doing? What am I doing? I wasn't listening to you. I'm sorry. Uh, huh. Where do I go? I don't know. I missed, I missed it. What did you want me to do? Oh, I could the shield. Uh, but I don't like shields. Oh no, not destroy it. Okay, what do you want me to do with the shield? So they give you scrolls here. This is how you learn your skills by reading the scrolls. And I have to kill the pigs now. Alright, so I'm gonna show you what um, other ways of fighting it are. 
Wait, what am I? I ho I'm holding an axe right now, so I, I guess he wants me to fight with the axe. But this is what melee combat is like. Very simple. And this is what uh, archery is like. Oh, let me just skin the pig first. Skinning is very important to us. And this is what the archer. I think I have one skill for archery. Yeah, I have one skill. <coughs> now I can be. Yeah, archery. Not as much fun as, as magic, I think. I prefer magic. So I'm gonna use that. Exclusively magic. With occasional melee. I have some loot as well. Oh, yeah. So there's lots of loot. There's lots of drops here. I already have like a million meat and other stuff. But I think I have to kill more pigs first. So I got a reward of my new items. So I'm gonna equip them right now. Is this better or worse? Uh, worse. Better. Okay, where am I going? So even though, even though the graphics are pretty simple, considering this is a browser game, I'm really impressed with what I see. Um, it does look a lot like RuneScape. Plays a lot better than RuneScape. And has this Diablo slash MMORPG kind of a thing going. So there's a person right there that's a female what I don't know I can't tell low 3p female I don't know what she's waiting there for but I think I have to do the quest first I'll accept this quest eh, eh? do I have to go inside the cave I think so so this is my one of my first caves if not the first cave Merkid Depths level one fancy music playing what's that what's that on the wall oh it's like stuff dripping down the wall you Alright, this goblin's here. I'm assuming they're going to attack me. Are you going to attack me? You are going to attack me, are you? And level up! Yeah, that's right. That's how I do it. I can't scan the goblin, unfortunately. Uh, caveman, kill it. Who is this person right here? Kills the goblin. Why is it red? I'll never know. This is something we'll never know why it was red. Oh, that's a wizard. That's why it's red. That explains everything. It explains everything. All right, almost there. Oh, I got some loot, and it's a goblin teeth necklace. That is a general loot. Okay, so I got my stuff. I got what I came for. Now I have to read. Oh, it was so close to me. I feel stupid because I went all around it. Hello. Goodbye. Okay, I'll find out. And I believe I'm level 4 now. Yeah. Give it to him. Okay. Nice. I finished that quest. This person is still here. Uh, mm, mm, mm. Find his wife. Seriously, you forgot your wife somewhere? That's nice. Oh, I can collect stuff. This is, uh, this is foraging, I believe. Yeah. This is my other skill that I, uh, other harvesting skill that I have. I can forage for stuff. Alright, so I believe this is a forager, right? He's gonna teach me how to forage. No, he's not. He just wants me to kill stuff. Wow, what a wonderful person. Cool, I'll do that. There's more quests here, actually. Let's go, let's go get everything. I'm sure it's all related to this cave where I am. Speak to Dante near... What? Alright, so I'm about to descend to the second level and find out what's down there. And it's another cave. Ooh, nice. And there's a goblin that has a name that doesn't really want to do anything with me. Lots of nasties in the cave. Alright, cool. That's cool. It's cool, bro. Is that where the wife is? Where am I? I'm right here. Yeah, his wife is. So I go left. Turn left. Oh, there's a spider here. Check it out. Level 5 spider. Oh, shooting stuff in. And I can skin it. Oh, but I need to have a skin in level 5. Alright, so this is the quest mission objective. Save the wife. She seems to be enjoying herself. Um. Yeah. 
she says she wants to stay here until he, he comes back and apologizes to her. Eh, okay, domestic disturbance. I don't want to deal with this right now. I'm just going to leave. Oh, I think I can go this way. I'm going to try the other way. See if it's different. And mission complete. So let's talk to this guy again. Oh, no, I killed the squirrel by mistake. Oops. Uh, wife, yeah, she doesn't want to talk to you. Yada, 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 yada. Quest complete. Ooh, red quest. What does that mean? Elite quest. Ooh. So different quests have different colors, which means different things. All right, I'll do your elite quest. Give it to me. Give me your elite quest. Uh, da -da -da -da. Yeah. Letter what? Oh, to your wife? Okay. Sure. I'll do that thing you're asking me to do. But first, let me return this quest. Okay, so here comes my first boss that I have to kill. He's right there. It's a hobgoblin, which is like a better goblin than other goblins. And I need to get in there first somehow. But how do I? Oh, here we go. Door. And that's one of my quests. That's some last line of quests that before I finish my missions in this city. Uh, so, okay, here goes nothing. I don't know what's going to happen, but he might defeat me. What's number seven? Is that my new skill? Uh, no, it's a resurrection skill. Okay, cool. Here goes nothing! Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. He's a lot more powerful. But no, I think I can beat him. I'm gonna use uh, a lot of healing. Oh, no, I can beat him. Oh, yeah, there we go. Lots of fireballs in your face. There we go. Okay, so he's dead. And I... Oh, I got my achievement. This is my 50th goblin. Oh, nice! And I got a blue item, which is a rare throwing weapon. Uh, do I... Can I use this? I guess I can. Oh, but it increases my sorcery. I don't want that. Okay. Well, that's good to know. So he dropped a cool item for me as well. Maybe I should kill another one. Should I just wait? I'll wait. Oh, no, he dropped the same thing. Ah, uh, seriously? Okay, and so now I have two of those meticulously thrown daggers. I guess he drops the same thing. So it's not random loot, unfortunately, but that's okay. All right, I just finished my first elite quest where I had to kill my first boss. And... Yeah, quest complete, that's right. Excellent. So, I'll be honest with you. So far, this game really impresses me. This is a really well-made MMORPG. Um, it's really, it has a really old school kind of a feel to it, and, oh, I have talents too, <gasps> no way, let's find out what my talents are, how do I do talent thing, is it T, oh, nice, so there's different, look at that, there's, uh, six different classes, so I can be a prophet, a mage, a ranger, an assassin, a warrior, or a templar, which I guess is a paladin, now, since I'm going for a mage, these are my talents that I'll be looking at. So, it's passive abilities. Oh, they're all passive. Oh, it's everything. Everything's passive. All right, so that I guess that makes me a stronger mage. Oh, wait. Did I just see an active? Nope. Still passive. Nope. Still passive. But nevertheless, though, this is a really impressive game. I'm, I'm actually... I would totally recommend that you try this. Especially if you, if you do like old-school MMORPGs or... If you want to try something that's, you know, you can play in your browser occasionally and something that's actually good and worth playing, this is totally the game. You, ne you need to try this if you if you have nothing to play right now. So this is called Eldavin, and I'm going to post a link for this below. Um, make sure to play this a little bit more and post another video about this later on. But right now, I totally recommend that you try this. So there's a map here, there's all these, like, your, this is your character sheet. This is your inventory, and it's it looks really advanced for a browser game, and or, or not even a browser game, just for an MMORPG. This is pretty good. The graphics are a little bit outdated, but I mean, this is a browser game, right? Anyway, so thank you for watching, and please subscribe to my videos. Um, I will be posting more and more RPGs, and I'll be talking about other games as well. So thank you, and like this video. Bye bye.